Okay, so I'm not even gonna bother uh, fucking butchering your last name. Yeah, yeah. Do you, do, yeah. <laughs> do you prefer people to try to take a shot at it, or just, just or just be like, just you ask. know what, fucking? No matter what, it's annoying. Like yeah. it's like just I'm Porphy. That's Jeremiah and Porphy. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't care. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so yeah, we're here with uh, Jeremiah. I'm probably still fucking would say it wrong. Um, just comedian, producer, and fucking yeah. in, uh, comedian, in, producer, writer. Producer, yeah. writer. There we go. Um, yeah, just fucking, uh, just here to fucking hang out with us. We got some, um, got some stupid shit for you to, for you to, you know, check out, and uh, we'll get you, <laughs> we'll get right. your, get your, uh, get your fucking takes on them. I'm excited. Um, all right, okay. Well, we'll do something. Actually, yeah, we'll do something just to kick off. Uh, oh shit. Um, hmm. Let's see. How do we? <laughs> so pe- 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 people usually people usually get uh, uh get a kick out of um the titles of some of the videos yeah. i save uh so here i'll let you kind of pick okay and uh we'll get we'll, we'll get we'll get rolling that way all right this is cool because i never actually listened to your podcast okay so i never i don't know what to expect yeah, yeah, yeah. i'm already excited okay uh, <laughs> well i'm I, excited I, by these titles yes yeah, yeah. like i did a, uh, i did an episode yesterday and uh within um i think about five minutes uh, the guests and I were watching um, hentai, so, <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, the, <laughs> it can, uh, it can, you know, things can kind of go yeah. <laughs> in any direction. So don't load that up for me. Like, that's hard. <laughs> so it's like, oh, I know, I already watched too much. You know? yeah. no. Try to cut know. back. Actually, yeah. how did that happen? Like, how did th- uh, they just mentioned that they, you know, were a fan of it okay. in a way, or they had watched it before? And then I was just like asking questions, and then right. they were like, actually, there's like this one that's like kind of like a whole like storyline yeah. thing and then he like named it and he's like actually we could like may- maybe like pull it up oh, <laughs> and, <shit. laughs> and then we <laughs> then we just started watching it and it was kind of like it wasn't like just you know it wasn't just all fucking okay, it was uh yeah. there was like a storyline there was it was a whole thing okay. um so that's how that happened it that's wasn't because <laughs> i've i've seen like actually watched hentai once and it was i think i was like 15 just mm-hmm. browsing porn and i was just yeah. like okay i actually watched it yeah and I feel like if I had actually like continued and like jerked off, I would have been on like a really dark path. Yeah, but luckily yeah, yeah. I didn't. Yeah. So I'm, I'm so yeah. So I, I feel like know. the only stuff yeah. I saw when I was younger was like uh, I don't even know if it counts as head tie. It was just like just like Family Guy shit. Oh, or like, yeah, like, or like, like Simpsons yeah, yeah, shit yeah, would yeah. like pop up, and, yeah. uh, and then like I don't know if that falls in. I mean, this probably yeah, falls. But in. you don't have a choice if you want to see that because it was just like up there. Yeah, so yeah, it's yeah. Like, yeah. It doesn't really count. Yeah, yeah well, yeah. it was up there, but yeah. then I was just like, oh, what's that? I tried, I tried trying. to find okay. it, and then uh, <laughs> okay, <yeah. laughs> and I was just like, yeah, yeah. you know, I, just, I had to see what was up. Yeah. But uh, yeah, see, I don't know if that counts as is that hentai or is that just cartoon? Um, I think does hentai have to be specifically like anime? There's a different thing called Rule Thirty Four. Which, have you heard of that? No. Okay, rule 34 is, like, the concept that no matter what it is, there's porn of it. So it's, like, oh, okay. cartoons or, like, yeah. like, anything. So I think that falls under rule 34. I'm pretty sure hentai is just anime. Okay, yeah. okay, yeah. Rule uh, 34. Yeah. <laughs> everything, <laughs> just, like, everything has its own porn. Yeah. Um, okay. All right, so, yeah, you can uh, you can go ahead and pick yeah. off the board I there. think I'll do uh, Nice Lady Looking for Love. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, uh, usually, well, I mean, I've kind of switched things up, but uh, in the past, I've, uh, when I have a guest on, I would, like, you know, actually, whether they're in a relationship or not, yeah. I would load up, uh, you know, a couple of a uh, couple of nice ladies and see, you know, just kind of get a feel for uh, what they're into. Okay. Um, but uh, well, yeah, we'll, we'll go right off the bat and see, uh, you know, see if you're see if you're into something like Ooh. this. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> let's 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 hold hold off on on judgment right now. If there's any good guys out there? I am looking for one. I ain't looking for a cheater. I am looking for a good guy that's going to be there for me and that that do for me and not may do for him. <laughs> so hit me up if you're out there. I don't understand any of what she's saying. You, you missed it all? Yeah. All right. She's looking for a good guy. Yeah. Not a cheater. Okay. Um, And somebody that will is willing to, like, set up, cook up dope for her, but, oh, okay. but doesn't do it themselves. Okay. So she's got very specific rules yeah. here. Those are, those are high standards. Yeah, she, yeah. she has very specific yeah. rules. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Do you feel like, I don't know, what you, you, you're not a, you know, oh, you're not a cheater. You don't do dope. I, okay. I, no, but I love, <laughs> I love, no. I love older women. Like, yeah? I love older women. Like, it's weird. Like what, like, like what age? Uh, like you're just saying like like MILF like, like talking MILF, okay. yeah like I'd say like 30 to like 45 like the oldest I've been with was 44, 44. and it was like it was like the greatest thing ever really but it was yeah it was like it was really hot just like um, after a show 
No, well, I, I didn't meet her at a show, yeah. but then we just went on a date and just like we're messing around for a bit. It was yeah. never gonna be anything serious, but like, yeah. yeah, that was really hot. But that's a bit too much for me. Th- th- this is uh, a like, yeah. Well, she could she could be she could just be a hard forty four. You know, like yeah, yeah, yeah like, sure. <laughs> like she the just was too much. Yeah, yeah she just yeah. really lived it the yeah. the forty four years. But um, so yeah, that forty four year old. That's yeah. uh, like you you were, you fucking loved it yeah dude i don't know it's just something different like i don't i don't know i have issues yeah. with my mom so yeah if you saw my phone contacts like i haven't talked to her for a while so that probably yeah. so then you were just like yeah. maybe 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 yeah. we'll go on a date yeah I know. you know what? i don't think it's fair how like the daddy thing is so like uh it's so like common yeah you know? why why how come i can't be like mommy you know? i know bro yeah, yo like, yeah exactly yeah. and uh it's not fair yeah Actually, yeah, I do. I have been doing this fucking. Uh, I tr- j- just recently tried it out. This fucking just this like daddy joke about because, like, if it's just a girl saying daddy, I was like, it's also like I feel like it's not that big of a deal if us as like a guy brings yeah. it up and you're just like, yeah, you know, like whatever. You're like, oh, call me daddy. But if yeah. the girl's just like, she's adamant about saying daddy, yeah. then it's just like, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Okay, hold on a yeah. second. <laughs> like, I don't yeah. know if I want to dig into this yeah. or not, but uh, you, you know, you, you really want to say that yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's like i did not i didn't ask for that yeah um but yeah i know the, the fucking yeah, yeah if you were to just throw out like if you were to just go mommy yeah no yeah i've never <laughs> i've never to be clear i've never thrown that out yeah <laughs> or just but, oh mother <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's that's worse mother, yeah, mother. <laughs> or or just my mo- or just your mom's name is worse <laughs> like just like yeah, yeah. Just oh up. shit like, yeah <laughs> yeah that would be fucking oh yeah. my god um yeah, are you uh are you a cheater at all? You ever cheated on no, anybody? No, 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 no. no? I've never, I've never, never done cheated. it. No, no, no. I don't. Yeah, I think it's. I don't understand how I could do it. Yeah, I just, I just couldn't go through with it. I guess. Fuck yeah, but dude. Like, I guess when people are like drunk and stuff. Or, yeah. Like, I don't know if in like a long marriage or something, then it might be different. But yeah, I don't know. I've never been married. Yeah, I've never been fucking the same person for ten years. So yeah. like, I don't know. I have no idea what it's like. Yeah. That's fucking, I mean, some people also just, yo, know, there's some people that just fucking love cheating, yeah, that's true. <laughs> which that's is true. like crazy. Yeah. You ever meet some people like that? They're yeah. just like, yeah, there's like, I don't know. I just fucking, I just, I don't know. I just cheat. Like, I, just, yeah. I just can't fucking, I don't know. I get, I go out and then like, I just get drunk. It and just then, happens. Yeah, yeah just I know. Happens, it's just yeah. like, dude, there's like, it's so easy to just not. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> um, that's good. Have you good, ever been dude. cheated on or no? Oh yeah. Oh fuck. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah, but it was also kind of my fault because I was just like, you know, I was just like, uh, I was just like, oh, you know, I was just like in denial about it. Oh, okay. So it's like, it's my right. fault. I mean, I, I, like well aware. <laughs> Where did you walk in? You're like, it's, I didn't the- see it. I'm, I'm schizophrenic. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is, yeah, I, yeah. Uh, it's my <laughs> own I'm, brain. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm just yeah, imagining sure. things. Would um, you, if you were married to her, would you cheat on her? Uh... I mean, I don't think, it, yeah, it doesn't matter who it is, a fucking ride or die, baby. Oh, sure. <laughs> wow. You're a good, you're a good man. <laughs> or I would just, or I would just be like, yeah, no. Like, well, she wouldn't want me if I, as well, I, maybe I would just start, you know, I'd start cooking up my own dope and then she, okay. she'd be out. Right, right. I, br- I broke good. her, I broke her turn. Yeah, so, do the classic, like, yeah. oh, make her break up with you. Yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah try that one it. out. Um, have you ever, uh, you ever been cheated on? No, no, no. No, nothing? No, you haven't no. had any, pro- so what, you just end relationships in a mature fucking, you know, adult way? No, it's just like. Actually, I guess I don't know if I've been cheated on. Mm. I've, I've only been in one, like that one serious thing. Yeah. So, yeah. So how long was that one? It was just like two years, just okay. eighteen to twenty, and, and it's like yeah. And, and since then, I've just been trying to date and failing. <laughs> you know, just failing at yeah. it. Failing how? Like you just not just finding crazy people or just no? Like a lot of it, a lot of it is me. Like I can honestly say, like <laughs> a lot of it is me. Because like and like for a really long time, plus COVID for like yeah. two years was yeah. like a big big thing but like for now now i'm actually trying to get more serious because for a while i was just like such a fuck boy yeah still am but like trying to try to undo that shit you know trying to yeah. at least take it a little bit more yeah exactly seriously so, yeah and fuck fuck boy in what terms what were you, what was your uh what were you what would you do what was your what was your method of operation no i just wanted to be like i just wa- was trying so hard to wow we're actually getting serious let's hear the it clips, the clips i saw from your podcast are like laughing and now it's like fucking soul searching no, 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 don't worry. Shit. It'll it'll go it'll go okay, up and down. Okay, it'll go up and down. Good. <laughs> it's good because there's like ass relationship on the screen, so that's like that's yeah, good. yeah. No, I would just say like I was going after people who I knew it wouldn't be anything. Okay, because I was like because I was like not getting laid before. Yeah, and then I was like now that I was like getting laid, it was like oh now I can just like be cool and just like fuck around. But yeah. now it's like I don't waste my time. 
Like if I'm not, if I don't genuinely like someone, I'm not gonna like pretend to. Yeah, just, just to, to like yeah. be late to be cool. Yeah, yeah. It's, not, <laughs> yeah. it's also I feel like it's so much like less cool to. Uh, to just like get laid when you yeah. like you get older because like when you were like when you're like fucking younger or whatever like in high school just outside like right. if you like getting laid by like a bunch of like different girls like your friends and like everyone's just like oh man but then like dude if you're like in your like mid 20s late 20s and you're just talking about it, you're just like dude i got like laid by so many everyone's yeah. like <laughs> it's like okay everyone's like all right bro yeah, well, no one <laughs> dude, like, yeah. it just it go it just goes from like oh that's sick to like kind of sad yeah, later on exactly. people are just like ah oh, yeah. all right are you are you like good if you kind of you're probably like filling some sort of hole yeah. right yeah and that's what it was with me like i yeah. was definitely like trying to you know did you ever have like a slut phase no bro i'm i'm oh. fucking i'm i'm dude i can't do it man i don't have it in me i'm just i'm a fucking i, I think i'm just built as a like relationship guy i can't oh, okay. i can't even like dude like fucking one night stand shits make me yeah. so uncomfortable yeah. And like I don't like I don't want to do it. Okay, I and, can tell uh, by the one D shirt they never had a one night stand song. So you're, you're yeah, they're all religious. <laughs> yeah, Every they're all song religious. Is some shit, man. Yeah, bro, <laughs> dude. Uh, man, I just I don't know. Like I just wouldn't care to like yeah yeah like you're saying now where you're just like I'm not gonna waste my time. I just yeah. wouldn't fucking bother. Like if I wasn't just like genuinely like into it, I couldn't fake it. Right. I would just like I actually couldn't fake it okay. even to like just go and get laid. I couldn't nice. do it. Yeah. And it shows cuz like if they were just talking to me I would just be disinterested and just be like uh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> so like I couldn't even fake my way through yeah. it to try to get laid of just it's like weird. the oh you know like <laughs> fucking just like whatever just try and like talk your way into yeah. it it just comes out as like I I don't know just, okay, I gotcha. don't give a fuck right um yeah cuz even with me now like when I try to like get a girl's number at like a bar or something like People who I'm with will be like, "Ah, oh, nice man," but it's like I'm just looking for love. Like I'm yeah. not trying to be cool, you know. Like, I just, yeah. <laughs> Which I you, you actually you you'll go up and you'll go up and ask a girl for a number. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's yeah, your yeah. Do, do you uh, do you do you like cycle fucking things? Like what's your how do you, how do you go about it? Um, okay. I don't know if I've honestly ever fucking done that. Like right. you know, um, like hello, if it's lady. at a show, like just like after stand up, yeah. I just like I just say, "Hey, did you guys like the show?" And then I try to be like, "What? Well, okay, there's this there's something before that." So I have a joke. That's like, oh, is anybody here single? Yeah. And if someone woos, I'm like, okay, who, that's who I'm going to hit up. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> so Hide it behind a joke. Nice. So then, I, so then I go up and I'm just like, oh, did you guys like the show? Who was your favorite? And yeah. And it's like, oh, it's supposed to be me. And then, it, you know, you just talk. You yeah. Start. Can I get your number? And then I just fucking get. Nice. And then, and then you know, it's so half the, with random numbers, like, they actually usually don't text back. Yeah. Like, so it's like 50%. But then it's like, hey. If you do, you go out. And yeah. It's like, so there's nothing wrong with it. It's yeah. just like that's usually my that's usually my thing. So you just fire off it. You fire off a text eh, when you get the number. Yeah, exactly. Dude, it'd be funny yeah. if you just called. Oh, <laughs> maybe I should call. Yeah. I've never done that. I've they would, never that would called. throw somebody off, especially yeah. in 2022. They'd be like, "What the yeah. fuck?" They'd be like, "I don't know this number at all." And if they do answer, which they probably yeah. wouldn't, then you're just like, "Hey, we uh, <laughs> we spoke we spoke the other night." Yeah. The, <laughs> they'd be like, "What it's is so happening?" Because right like now? in the span of like ten years, calling is now like creepy. Dude, yeah, like, people like, people are creepy. not into yeah. it. Yeah, it's, I don't fucking I'm not into it. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'll watch. Like my friend will call me who just said he was gonna call me, and I'll just like watch it ring. I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, ah. what are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm mean, like, I don't know, dude. That's funny. Like how fucking <laughs> like what do you have to tell me? Just yeah. like, it can't be that long. Exactly. And if it is. I, I don't know. If, I don't, I don't, yeah. I don't really yeah. care to hear. I think the only person I call is family. Like that's it. Yeah, that's it. So, yeah, and yeah. like, uh, and just like, yeah, just kind of like a quick like FaceTime, and then right. I just like, I mean, I don't know. Like I never. I, I'll sometimes now call and like just chat quickly with like my girlfriend for like okay. five ten minutes. Right. But like, yeah. Other than that, actually, I've got some friends now that like fucking try to call me and shit, and like, uh, and like. Yeah, like I said, like I'll just watch it sometimes, and then like I don't know, I'll answer, and they'll just be like, "Yeah, I do." Like, what are you? Like, what are we? What are you doing? What are, yeah. Like, it's like, dude, what is? It? What <laughs> do is they leave this? a voicemail? No, no. Oh, no. But like, okay. if I answer, yeah. then they'll just be like, "What are you? Like, what's up, man? Yeah. Like, what are we doing? Da, da, da. I'll be over there, whatever time." It's like, oh shit! What are you guys yeah. calling yeah. me? They're younger <laughs> than me too, oh, so okay. I'm like, I don't even understand what. The, like, I, I thought this was done. Well, maybe that's a thing now. Like, maybe calling will be a just thing. comes back around. Yeah, maybe yeah. maybe we're just old and like we don't understand. Yeah, like yeah, fuck, that's weird. Yeah, Jesus. you calling your friends? Yeah, no. I would don't. you would you do that? Just no. call your buddy and be like, "Hey, man, like, what's up?" No, no. no. <laughs> Even my best friend, like, I still, yeah. I've, we haven't called each other in like years. Yeah. So yeah, no. 
Yeah, that'd be funny. Uh, just fucking yeah. I say I say you call one of these girls one time. Just call. Yeah, I will try that. And just see what that. happens. I'll try that. Yeah, but I'll try that like ten minutes after. <laughs> <laughs> hey, like, we, just want to make sure you didn't forget about me, like yeah. or some shit. Yeah, yeah. Just fucking make it really. That's good. I'll try to call. <laughs> <laughs> see, see how That's it good. works out. Yeah. Um. Yeah. All right. So um. Okay, so we're finding we're finding out a lot about you right off the bat. Um. Oh, dude. Okay. Hold on. Let's uh let's check this out. This is some fucking since we're You've just heard talking the terminology, about terminology, cyberspace, the web, hard drive, the internet. Today we want to explore cybersex in cyberspace. My name is Jolie and I'm going to show you how to enjoy the stimulating world of the internet sexual playground. <laughs> 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 Dude, that's an awesome fucking commercial. Yeah. But um I learned from her. I, yeah, I'd learn from her. Yeah, dude, <laughs> right, sure, yeah. dude, this is like I don't know if this is like recent and they tried to make it look old, or like if this is legitimately from like when the internet was fucking. Yeah. But because what would have been the old like cyber sex? Um, I'm pretty sure just typing. Just, but there's still webcams back then, right? So, were, was there like right away like? Uh, webcams were what probably like the 2000s like, so this looks 90s i guess yeah, yeah this looks like fucking like the very first shit so i guess just like what just sending messages and like aol just like yeah. yo like w w what are you wearing i'm <laughs> pretty sure it would have been yeah chat rooms and shit i'm sad that i missed that stuff though i wonder i wonder what it was because like i don't know porn is too much you know like yeah. hardcore porn is like too much so yeah it's like, i know we kind of yeah we kind of missed like the by the time we were, yeah, we, we had, like, everything. Yeah, exactly. So, like, yeah, we didn't have to, like, you know, try and... Well, also maybe a good thing that we didn't have to go into fucking chat rooms and... Uh, Talking to, like, a 40-year-old Yeah, guy, yeah and like, uh, <laughs> try to figure it out yeah. that way, because uh, that might have been a little dicey. Yeah. Uh, but, I mean, it's it's so funny to just fucking... Yeah, you're just, like, just messaging yeah. and... That just getting horny off the words. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, that's like, fuck, man. It's People a, it's, must have been, back then must have been really good writers, though. Like, they must good, have been great Good writers, writers yeah. and just, like, just their minds are just so much more, like, imaginative yeah. and, like, just creative. Because they're just sitting there, like, it's just, they're, like, just making it all in their head. Because they just have to go off, like, the words. And right. then it's like, uh, it's like fucking, dude, have you ever, I, I, I talked about this a while ago, where it's just, like, and fucking girls love this shit. That's why, like, romance novels and stuff yeah. are, like, so popular. Dude, if you fucking start reading, like, I, I I picked up this book one time and just started reading it, and it was just straight up, like, those romance novels get fucking pornographic as oh, fuck. They're they, actually just porn. I they, didn't... Yeah, it's just, oh, okay. it's just, like, fucking fiction porn. Shit. Like, just in writing. And, like, it, and I was, like, I was, it made complete sense after that. I was like, yo. And actually, because it's like you, like, makes you think of all the shit yourself. Okay. And then I'm just like, I was like, dude, this is, I was like, that's hilarious, man. These girls are just fucking horny as hell uh, reading these fucking books. Dude, I'm writing the wrong thing. Because I write, like, fa fantasy and science fiction. Oh, yeah? So it's like, that's the wrong thing. I should be oh. doing, I would have so many fans. Dude. I would have so many Yeah, man. Fans. Oh, my God. Dude, just uh, do, uh, do that, but with a, yeah, like a, you know, alien. erotic fucking. I should, oh, I'll do aliens and the romance shit. So then I can just do both. Okay, yeah. yeah that's that's smart. Okay. What do you, uh, what do you do your, like, you write sci-fi, like, what, like? Yeah. actual like novel stuff or like yeah like novels like i wrote oh, i have a no i have a book out hive uh oh shit that out uh so i have that but i'm writing a nine book series so it's like it Damn. jumps genres but it's gonna take like 20 years yeah so yeah it's gonna take a while but yeah like but it's all the thing with that is it's not like like i've chosen things to do that like don't really get girls like not like a musician or something right like yeah yeah, like yeah a fucking comedian and like a fantasy author is not like the best for it. <laughs> it's not like so. I don't know. But it also, hey, it depends, dude. It it's depends, only, man. Yeah, yeah. I think I think it depends because if um, you know, at the same time, like, there's different girls that are attracted to different, uh, yes. you know, things. And also, if you get successful at either one of them, then it's then you're then fine. it's a different yeah. game. Yeah. And yeah. also, it's the same thing. If you're like just a shitty fucking musician. The girls that are India are also are you know not 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 the not the you know top tier ladies yeah. <laughs> that are like you know that are like banging dudes that are like yeah like fucking you know playing it's like bar to like four people right and there's like terrible yeah. like and then that girl so I mean like if you're if you're a really really good successful you know sci-fi writer or comedian true then, the, then the girls are into the it. Thing. I think nerd girls get too much attention though. 
Because they're, like, so, surrounded. Oh, right. They're, like, because yeah. I, I, one time I went to this, like, Street Fighter tournament thing, and, like, there was a ring girl there. Uh, and there was <laughs> she was yeah. surrounded by literally like 12 dudes yeah like, uh, like just like so yeah just so much like pent up yeah, fucking exactly. like yeah and they're just so like, it's like I, I didn't even try to go with her because it was just like i'm not i have self-respect to yeah. not try to be the 13th guy the th- you know <laughs> like i, I would have been the smoothest out of all of them yeah but like i'm just I, i'm not doing it you know yeah so, yeah that's fucking it's funny. It's so though. cringy though. Like when you see like three guys like trying to get with a girl or even like two or like yeah. it's just like, I but, don't know. But weird. then also those girls like, do they, are, do they just like crave that attention or are they like. Well, everyone likes attention. I don't think yeah. it's a thing. But I like, I feel like that like, attention is also like a different one because it's like, yeah. they're like very, like it's like an awkward, like they're like, ag- not, not aggressive about it, but they're like, they're. <laughs> they're, they're like i don't know overly like excited about it because like yeah. they, i don't know i guess they don't i guess they don't hang out hang out with a ton of chicks right so then they're like fucking like buzzing around this girl and like oh like and just like maybe like i don't know looking up like or like she's a fucking queen so maybe yeah, exactly. she's like she's into that yeah i i would be if i was a girl like yeah. I, would, I would totally love i'd be such an insta hoe if i was a girl dude yeah because i already love attention yeah so like yeah Fuck, you'd be, you'd be just about. posting your body. Yeah, yeah, oh, oh, for sure, hundred yeah. percent. Oh yeah. yeah, would you like n- no fucking shame about it? Just like not even like trying to hide it. Just no, I I probably have an OnlyFans by now. Honestly, <laughs> yeah. Would Would you do it if you're what like only if you're a chick? Yeah, man, I probably would start out as like I. But see, like that's the thing is like I mean, tons of girls always like, fucking go that route where they're just like ah, you know, like I've thought about like doing this stuff, but like I don't want to like you know show my face or like like either go like not fully nude and yeah. show their face or they go fully nude and try to like hide their face. Okay. But then like, I, I feel like, I feel like it doesn't work if you, uh, if you don't like, if you don't fully commit. Yeah. I feel like the guy, like, I feel like the guys want like a fair trade off where it's just like, you have to, you know, like throw your fucking hat in the ring and be like, all right, I'm just putting everything online or whatever. And then yeah. people pay for it. If it's just like some girl that's just like, I'm taking, you know, sexy bikini pics and putting them on my only fans for like five dollars a month guys are like yeah face is face is important like yeah. i think face is like it, it's a part of it it's the whole package that you yeah have. yeah yeah i actually went on a date somebody with someone like a long time ago and then they uh they fall they like one of their one of their alternate accounts on instagram followed me and it was like it turns out it was like an only fans and i was like oh shit like i didn't pay for it or anything. yeah but i was like i never like fucked or anything but like yeah. it was interesting to see like it's not just like it's very real. It's like normal girls who do it. You yeah. Know? It's not like, yeah. yeah. There's some girls in like, uh, that just have like any kind of following yeah. for like whatever reason. And then, uh, and then, yeah, they just post pictures like, cause they, there's some of them, like very few, they kind of have to have a following beforehand. Mm-hmm. If, if you're going to like kind of go that route of not being naked and, you know, like fucking yourself on there. Yeah. Then, um, where they'll, yeah, they just like have their bill. I knew, I knew a girl, a fucking just regular girl. But like, kind of had a following from a, uh, from like a fitness. Okay. And just would post pictures of like in her underwear mm. on there, paying her rent. Fucking fuck. like so, and it's just like, whoa, yeah. bro, what the fuck, dude? Well, like, how much do you think they make though? Like, if it's like, say, it's like, cause I, if it's like a lower end account, like, how much do they charge a month? Do you know? Like, like it could be like, yeah, like like five, eight dollars per person okay. or something like that. Yeah. And then there's like, but it's there's like that's like subscriptions, and then uh. Actually, I'm learning more about this because I might be doing some fucking editing work for uh oh. for a like a a real one Shit. that's like uh a lo- like actual porn star. Okay. Um, I connections crazy about how I got in contact with these people, but I might yeah. It, how'd you uh, how'd you get in contact? With you? <laughs> um, okay. So a family member of mine. Um, uh, it starts with a family member. Yeah, I my know. Mom. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so, anyways, my mom, <laughs> my mom's super into the yeah. porn industry. Um. <laughs> A, a family member of mine, uh, like, um, has a, just this neighbor and they started like talking to this, this neighbor and like the neighbor, uh, had to like, they had a, a job, um, that kind of like, they had like a practice that they lost kind of from COVID. Okay. So then they were just at home and, um, and like, uh, the husband, his like, o- his like old friend from school or something like moved to LA, became like this porn director. And, uh, he was just like, he knew that she was at home from her fucking practice, like closing down. It was just like, Hey, like. Um, you know, all, all these porn girls have only these only fans accounts and they need people to like message on them and just like okay. be active on them right. because they, they pretty much have to keep them running, 
uh, like 24 hours a day. Because if they're in conversations with the guys, the guys can send tips. Oh, great. and that and they make a shit ton of money that way. Oh, that's probably a huge. And number. they like and they like push videos and like you can unlock this video for five extra dollars. Right. So like they could get like they could see like a little teaser of it and then they like unlock it for five dollars. So they have to be active on it 24 seven. So they hire people to fucking message all these dudes <laughs> and pretend to be them. Oh, that's so funny. And so they were just, so the guy was just like, I know you're like at home or whatever. And like, yeah. um, and you know, you lost your practice. If you want to just do this, it's like really good money. It's not like, you know, it's not fucking crazy. And, um, and so she just started doing it. And then, uh, she ended up like the girl that she was doing it for. She was just like a part of a company, but then the girl that she was like doing a lot of the work for ended up like loving her okay. and was just like, Hey, I like, actually I'm thinking about leaving the company. Uh, what do you think about just running my shit? And then she's like, okay, sure, I'll do it. Pretty much like dumping like a million dollar business into her hands. Because uh-huh. at the high end, it would make like $110,000 a month Holy on shit. her fucking OnlyFans page. And then like, um, and then it would kind of like dwindle down, which is why she wanted to leave the company. She felt like, they had like 20 girls going at the same time, okay. which is like a fucking, that's crazy. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so she wanted to leave and just like do it on her own. And then, uh, and then so she asked this girl and then uh, the girl's like, oh fuck, I don't know anything about, you know, like video editing or like how to do any of this shit. So she just like mentioned it to the person that I know. Yeah. And they were just like, well, actually I know someone who does video editing. And it was like, I could ask it. And then I was just like, are you fucking kidding me? Yes, dude. Yes, so <laughs> much fucking money too. Shit. Like the only fan shit is nuts, dude. Yeah, that's why. Like, I, part of me kind of wants to do it. Like, I don't yeah. know. That's but, I don't but know. see, if you're a I'm guy, like, yeah, if yeah. you're if you're a guy getting into it, you gotta like you gotta find some wild niche. Yeah, like that's uh, they, they mentioned that too. They were just like, uh, they were like, um, they're like, since she's already just a really popular porn star, she okay. doesn't have to do anything right. like crazy. But they're like the amount of people that are like trying to because it's just such a like overpopulated yeah, fucking exactly. thing now yeah. that is just like to try and stand out or like create something on OnlyFans now is like you have to just fucking do like wild shit okay or just really appeal to a certain group yeah of, yeah. yeah okay yeah I guess I'll just like cut off my arm or something yeah you, yeah, like, yeah yeah you're just a one arm yeah, like exactly one arm <laughs> black guy it has yeah. To be, yeah or you'd like wear no, something no. crazy you're like like i don't know you're like always like in a diaper or something yeah. and like <laughs> yeah. and like yeah you like i do a diaper i'm not i don't have a problem with a diaper. <laughs> i would i don't yeah it's not that bad but yeah. worse things than a diaper. and then yeah. uh i don't know you have like a diaper maybe you just like you know like I don't know, like suck a cucumbers or yeah. something like that. <laughs> None just, of these are bad. Yeah. <laughs> these are, these are bad. Honestly, I'm kind of down for all of them. You didn't for how much nudity yet? Like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah, both of those are just, uh, yeah. you know, they're, right. <laughs> they're just an entry. We'll see. We'll see where it yeah. ends up. See, we've gone. A, we've gone a long way from the wholesome cyber site. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know, I know. Was, yeah, we'll see. But that's where we're yeah. at. It started as fucking, you know, people just chatting back. She's and wearing forth. a full sweater in that too. Like, <laughs> it's like how fucking. From a, from a like a fall Christmas sweater. I know. Is it this diaper? Like, this setting the setting is hilarious yeah. for this thing. They're just like, all right, okay, we have to shoot this cyber sex commercial. Um, there's like, okay, location. What do we think? Yeah. It's just like, maybe out by the lake would be nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice fall day. What if we just have her like walking, walking down by the water and uh, <laughs> <laughs> just like for the cyber sex? It's like, yeah. yeah, you know why this, not? Uh, it reminds me of those like remember watching those like puberty videos in middle school in class and yeah. everyone would be like dying laughing. Yeah, it's like for some reason they thought it was a good idea to yeah. show like a, di- a diagram of like a boner and then it just like jizzed. Like they oh, thought this yeah. was a good idea to show 12 year old boys. Like why would they? It was fucking ridiculous. Oh man, did you remember fucking, I was just thinking about it like uh, do you remember having to watch the, did you guys have to watch the giving birth video? No, I never watched that. Bro, it was crazy, man. It was fucking crazy. And especially it was like, it was like during a time when like, um, you know, you had, you frequent like having in class boners right. for, for me right, anyway, right, right, right. it was just like a weird overlap where I was just like, oh, okay, well this is, I, I like, I've got a, you know, I've got an in class boner right yeah. now. There's a baby <laughs> being born. I was just like, this is, I, this is going to fuck up some things in my brain. Let's see. Is it like one like this or is it more? Well, it would be like the ones with like a storyline. Like it would be like really shitty. It wasn't like, it wasn't like this. It was like, it would have like real people and it was just like, I don't know. Oh, uh, they've weird. made them all fucking. Yeah. They made them all. Dumb. <laughs> Cause it would be like kid actors. Yeah. yeah none of these are, <laughs> and they were just like, why are they all cartoons? What the fuck? <laughs> uh, yeah. They, they removed all <laughs> yeah. the fucking kids. 2000s. Let's yeah, see. That would probably be. Yeah. Like it was like this shit. Yeah. Always change 1997. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs>
A 50, 50 minutes, <laughs> bro. Holy shit. God. You know, I'm concerned about, oh, shit. Sponsored by Tampax. Or always. Always, okay. yeah. Always changing school programs provided a free service. Nice. <laughs> 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 Fuck that man I wanna watch this on IMAX Yeah I'm gonna have to cancel guys To be a woman That's what Mrs. Tardisky says The video's called I don't think I'll even go Look at these fits Well how yeah. are we gonna find anything out then But I bet I already talked about it Mrs. Tardisky said it's a video Everyone can learn from I'm going I just don't know what the big deal is Like I said I'll just ask my mom I just hope it isn't stupid and embarrassing <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I was just like, all right, cut. You're you're yeah, overacting. Yeah. You're overacting. What are you doing? Oh, stupid, stupid and, embarrassing. and embarrassing. It's just like nobody nobody talks like yeah. that. Let's see what the fuck it in class. Oh, they got some diagram. I feel like if I was a teacher, I'd be so uncomfortable looking at like a twelve year old and being like, "You guys know about erections? Yeah, like, is, that, is this okay? I know, like, is man. That okay, and it's crazy. Like, girls have girls start at different times. Oh, you just happen to be one of the first. But there's always something to learn. So go see the video. Keep your ears open. And if you like, we can talk more about it later. Thanks, Aunt Shelly. Oh, they're watching the video in class? Oh. Attention. <laughs> See, like, why is the principal <laughs> there? <laughs> like, oh, periods. All right, like, we're talking periods yeah. today, everybody. Pay attention. Yeah. Remember, Boys, no laughing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the girls will be watching their video with Mrs. Dominez and me, and the boys will be going with Coach Runway oh, okay. to see their video. Okay, there you go. Okay, guys. Coach. <laughs> this guy. All right, boys, let's go yeah. talk. Let's go talk boaters in the other Can't room. Yeah. <laughs> All right, girls, I, I do like the music, though. Yeah. This is so funny. The soundtrack is good. Yeah. Okay. Now we're going to watch the video. Now, it doesn't go into every detail about puberty and menstruation. But well, it does that would be such a long video. Yeah. And I will answer any this is hilarious. This is a fucking movie. Yeah. Growing up to be a woman. Oh, there's the cartoon. This is yeah. the part. All right. <laughs> Let's see where they go to the boys here. Yeah, it's going to be a diagram of an erection, I think. Oh, body temperature. The sweat they produce is odorless. Oh, the oh, they're telling boys <laughs> to fucking put yeah. deodorant <laughs> on. Where's the boner diagram? Oh, we got to get this guy talking to the boys about yeah. fucking boners. This is a fascinating journey. Oh, 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 there you go, there you go. All of the changes you are experiencing are part of getting your body ready for reproduction. That doesn't <laughs> mean you're ready for the responsibility of raising a child, just that your body <laughs> is getting ready. Okay. <laughs> Don't be going fucking having yet. kids. When a man gets sexually excited, his penis fills with blood and stiffens. Oh, oh I, yeah. dude, I remember that exact yeah, image. Like, yeah, at this, this time, is like what, this is everyone was dying at this. Yeah. And then like, I in think it's going to come. Yes, <laughs> yes, 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 <laughs> yes. Let's use the same diagram in every video. I think it's going to come. Yeah. <laughs> Just, uh, holy shit. That's fucking hilarious. Oh it my God. It got excited God. really easily. Like it didn't even get touched. <laughs> yeah, just like, it just pops up yeah. and just comes immediately. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. It, is it the coach's voice? Yeah. Like? Ejaculation. Ejaculation can also occur while you're sleeping. This is commonly called a wet dream. <laughs> During puberty, a boy will often have erections anytime and It is so funny that they just like sexually aroused. That they do this. Yeah. It can be embarrassing, but it is But it's like what normal. it's it's no matter what it's awkward cuz like what way is there to do it? Like cuz it's like I know cuz yeah. then like do you either like put it on like the parents and just be yeah. like yeah you guys have to do it cuz then like you know there's tons of parents that are uh We'll call it aloof. Yeah. That uh, you know, aren't, yeah, aren't, aren't yeah. necessarily, you know, focused on their children. Yeah. <laughs> and, so, and they just don't tell them anything yeah. or don't bother to educate them or like or let them know what yeah. the hell is going on. And then those kids are fucking, you know. Exactly. Like Or there's like the abstinence only type, which is like yeah. oh, they don't say anything about sex, yeah. which is like which is weird yeah. too. And it yeah. leads to like weird like sexual shame and all this shit of like, it, oh am I bad? Yeah. Cause I'm attracted to someone, like, you know, all that bullshit. Yeah, so and then like, it usually leads to um, somebody being, you know, a whore. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like me. Like, that's, dude, in grade five, I had to miss out on, like, our uh, our puberty uh, talk because my mom, like, pulled me out. Cause she was, Actually? Like, yeah, she's, like, a Christian, right? Like, pretty oh. hard. So, like, in grade five, I had to miss it because she was like, I don't know what's in that video. Yeah. So, and the thing is, like, now, like, me, my brother, like, before he was in a relationship, and my younger sister, like, we're all whores. Yeah. So, it's, like, that's, like, a thing. Like, yeah. there's something wrong. The, <laughs> like, yeah, the, not, like, repressing it, yeah. like, kind of just, yeah. Actually, yeah, dude, fucking, uh, 
the girl I dated like a long time ago, her family was like so weird about it with her of like, and just, we were dating for a long time too. And they were just like weird about like us, like not wanting us to like, or even mention it. it okay. Whoa. Massive whore. Oh, massive uh, whore. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Massive whore. And, yeah. uh, and it was just like, I mean, it makes complete sense now that yeah, like, it was just like, it was like a, a topic that, you know, wasn't like allowed to be talked right. about it. Like family didn't want to, you know, think about her having sex or like, or like us. It was like, dude, we've been together yeah. for like three years. Like, Did what? What did they, did they just like not like let you guys be in the same room? Like we weren't, well, yeah, we weren't allowed to just like go hang out in a room. We weren't, weren't allowed oh, to, I would fuck. like together for a long time. Right. We, like, uh, I would have to sleep like in the basement okay. and like she would have to sleep upstairs in her room right. and like, like she would be allowed to whatever, stay over at my place and stuff. But then there was just like a, you know, mm. fucking out of sight, out of mind kind of would not think about yeah. it. Uh, and like. Like, oh, I'm sure his parents are, you know, being responsible and yeah. making, making making sure that they're, uh, you know, sleeping in separate rooms and, sure. uh, you know, not having, uh, you know, fucking whatever. Not the problem. I don't know if it was like a premarital, probably not a premarital thing, but yeah. uh, was it a like a religious thing or something else? I I think they were kind of like a religious family, but it wasn't like a, it wasn't like a like overly overly, okay. overly religious okay. where, but like definitely a family that went to church sometimes and like so it was probably something to do with that right um but uh yeah man dude people that fucking people that go to the church just yeah man they church just is... turns them into fucking sex demons yeah it does man it's weird. <laughs> like i know yeah i think it's just like because it's the weird part is it's like a natural thing and then it gets treated like it either doesn't exist or like oh it's only supposed to be in marriage but it's like yeah. sexual attraction still exists yeah like, and it's okay to not have sex like that's not the problem it's just the fact that it's ignoring ignoring that it exists it's just ignoring yeah, yeah human nature problem, and just like, like telling you that like yeah like you know you have to you know you have to ignore you have to fight yeah, exactly. those urges and like, then you you can't have lust like it's like lust is just like when you see someone everyone has lust it's yeah. just like because when you see someone and you're attracted to them, that's mm-hmm. lust. Yeah. And it's just, I don't know, it, it, it leads to some weird shit. My parents also didn't do anything to, like, talk about, like, porn or anything like that either. Yeah. So it's like, I don't know, what did they think that I was going to do? Just, like, not, like, it is, yeah, like, just, you know, yeah. like, how horny you someone is. Yeah, like, like what, yeah, what would like, be the plan then? Yeah. Like, <laughs> and especially if your mom was just like, yeah, like this, where she's just like, I don't even want you really watching, like, yeah. the video. Then what's the game plan? Yeah, exactly. Just fucking, you know, like, never bring it up ever, then you just have to somehow come right. to some sort of fucking understanding of things what was it like did your parents give you the i don't th- i don't remember having like a a talk like um because like my dad grew up fucking super catholic oh, so like okay. he also okay. kind of has like that weird catholic thing where it's just like having you know talks is like a it's like a weird fucking thing okay um but uh so i don't i don't think we had just like a talk i think my parents were just like yeah you know like you'll fucking figure it out at school and like um, they never gave me like a porn talk. Mm. Um, oh, did you ever find your porn on like your dad's computer? No, oh. but I don't know if they found, <laughs> I don't know if they found like, cause like, dude, I used to, I used to fucking look up girls kissing on YouTube in my fucking, oh, in my like family, <laughs> family computer yeah, living room. I remember that shit just straight Maybe up. Maybe your dad was looking at the same thing. Yeah. He just, yeah, yeah. he just like super vanilla yeah. stuff. Just, yeah. yeah. YouTube girls kissing. Yeah. Dude, I remember doing that. I was just like, oh my God, I thought I was going to be in so much shit. Yeah. And it was the hilarious pressing enter on that and just like scrolling through them. And I was like, yo, this is wild. Oh. Oh my bro, God. and then I was probably like fucking thirteen or something, <laughs> and just yeah, right in the living room, <laughs> the living room computer, and then just yeah, like deleting all this fucking shit. Um, and that's so different now because that's what we had. But um, I remember my my girl just told me the story like not too long ago that like some family friends of theirs, they like their son who's like fourteen, like fifteen years old, super big anime guy, da da da, and like his parents found like so much hentai porn oh my God. that they were just like what do we say yeah. to this like to the point where they brought it up to their friends at like a oh, dinner or something where they're just like what do we even do about this jesus christ <laughs> so it's so different because like my parents i mean back in the day like fucking me looking up girls kissing yeah. on youtube they would have been like okay well like i mean <laughs> you know that's not let's not that's not even that's not bad yeah that's, that's, that's not fun. bad yeah. and let's also not do that maybe on the you know on the fucking family computer yeah. you're gonna be interested in that stuff like da, 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 da. it's fine just be careful with it maybe but like now with so much access to this shit yeah. dude a kid is like Even three clicks VR. away from yeah. fucking yeah like so the wildest porn you've ever fucking Jesus seen Christ. 
Yeah, I was actually I was caught masturbating once by my mom, oh, but yeah? I wasn't. I wasn't. This is when I was like really young, so I was like like 12, 13. like flat out caught, like dick yeah. in hand. No, because I was like eleven or twelve, like first started experimenting. So yeah. I was fucking my floor. Like my <laughs> <laughs> I was. Bang. Hold on, hold on. You gotta I was, a little bit more detail. Okay, so I was, <laughs> I was fucking my I was floor. Fucking, it was carpet, so it was soft. Okay. And but there's nothing to like, so you're just like. No, I would just like rub the floor. <laughs> okay, like, yeah. okay. Yeah. But this is like, because this is what I would do when, like, I, my first experimentation was when I was like eight or nine. Yeah. Which is what I would do because I was like, oh, that feels good. But yeah. I, in my head, I didn't call it masturbation. I'd be like, oh, the wiggly thing. I don't oh, know why. Uh, okay. I don't know why. You gave it a fun, fun yeah, kid name. It was a fun thing. I was like, oh, the wiggly thing. I'm doing the good. wiggly thing. But I was just like fucking in the floor, and then like my mom just like walked in, and then she's like, oh, sorry, and I used to close the door, and as she was like. Going, I was like, I'm changing. <laughs> Wait, I'm just, this I'm, is I how I change yeah. now. Yeah, I, just, yeah. I don't know. I'm doing a new thing. Yeah. I changed this way. Yeah, so I didn't know I was gonna tell that story today. But, <laughs> yeah, like, That's so funny. Yeah, but I've never. But then after that, I don't. I was never caught with like jerking off. Or yeah, like that. I don't yeah. think I've ever been caught by my parents. But one time, so once I got re- shit really popped off for me in the fucking in the porn. St- uh, like space. Once I got a fucking iPod Touch. Yes, me too. That's me too. What, yeah, that's yeah. when shit got popping. Yeah. I had an iPod Touch, and I fucking I knew my way around red tube. Yeah, and, <laughs> and I remember putting. I had uh, I had like a fucking like iPhone like dock station okay. to like or like an iPod dock station, and I would put the phone there uh overnight to like charge, and then it would like connect and do like the alarm that yeah. way. And I remember my grandparents were looking after me one time, and I guess I forgot to close the porn from the night before and it just instead of playing like my alarm it just started playing the sound oh, so shit. i i just wake up to my grandpa's like standing there, he's just like aiden, aiden and there's just po- fucking just the sound no video <laughs> just the sound playing and i'm like i'm fucking i'm yeah. like what the fuck and i'm just like sp- like smashing shit pressing stuff and then i was just like i, I don't yeah like i was just like oh what what is oh. that like Playing it off, I was just like, I was like, that's a, what, that's an alarm, that's yeah. a weird alarm. <laughs> yeah, I was like, that's a, yeah, I was like, I don't know what the fuck, that's a weird song. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> like, that was the only, like, weird call I had. Oh, I wonder my if my God. grandpa fucking, I mean, there's no way, how do you forget that? Yeah. yeah there's yeah. no way. Yeah, true. Well, I, mean, I guess, uh, well, are you going to be happy when he gets, like, dementia? <laughs> like, yes. like, like, the doctor's going to be like, yeah. yes. It's like, I was just like, you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything's like, wiped? Good. Yeah. <laughs> like, all of it? All right, like, yeah. there's not even any memories? Yeah. Okay. All right, good. Great. There's just like, yeah, just yeah. a big smile on your face. Everyone's just like, I don't know. He just yeah. seems weirdly happy about yeah, grandpa wow. having Alzheimer's. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's, like, the poor stuff is why, like, I'm scared of having kids, too. Because, like, it will be worse. When, oh, yeah. So it's like, I don't know how I would approach it because yeah. I know you can't just say ignore it yeah i know that and i know that if we have a computer or some shit they're gonna find a way yeah they're gonna be at their friend's house and like i know that for me like i think porn is actually overall bad like i know it's bad for me yes just for me it's been yeah it's not been a, for a lot of reasons and mm-hmm. it's like i don't know what the fuck i would do you know it's yeah just like, it's weird it's just yeah because it's like uh especially when everything is just fucking a screen yeah exactly like the kid's entire life's gonna be a screen and then the internet is just so fucking widely accessible everything yeah, yeah so like i mean and then just naturally kids fucking there's always and especially there's always a kid that's just like hey yo yeah exactly check yeah. this shit out like what it's was, like uh, early. Was your first time like a porn um actually uh i told this story not too long ago uh this uh this kid i grew up with um he was he was this gay kid Okay. And he showed me porn. Oh, okay. And okay. and uh and like he was just like, yeah, dude. He was fucking. He was a, he was the red tube master. He's like, look at this. The fucking oh, categories. Shit. He would like show me all the shit. And like and he just fucking showed me all of it. And I was just like, oh shit. Yeah. Uh, just yeah, opened up the entire fucking world for me. And then like, but I could only do it when we were at his house. Oh, okay. And right. uh, <laughs> yeah. and also, he was the one that uh introduced me that uh if you. Uh, you know, p- apply peanut butter to your, uh, you know, regions downstairs. Uh, dogs will lick it. Okay. <laughs> he, he brought that up oh to me one God. time, and that was like, you have to try it. Oh, shit. And uh, I did. Wasn't into it, oh, but uh, yeah. 
he was pretty into it. So I was like, oh, yeah, man, that was, that was pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> was it the same dog? Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, Actually, that's... there was two of them. There was two, okay. like, twin dogs. So it was I, it was like one of them. Okay. No, I, okay. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cause that's, <laughs> okay, cool. Because I also, that's not shameful. Because, like, I also, like, my friend, like, the first time I watched, it was also at his house in his basement. Yeah. Want to watch porn. Okay. And we would, like, we would jerk off together. Yeah. Like, so it'd be, like, he'd be, like, uh, looking. Like, it would just be, like, but there'd be, like, a mirror. So we could like see each other. Oh, really? Yeah, we just like yeah. We yeah, we like, would just put like yeah. like I mean we would just do like the classic like I mean like doing gay shit but like not fucking we just put a bunch of pillows in between oh, you and okay. it's just yeah. like yeah this makes it not gay yeah. because because <laughs> there's a pillow fence. Yeah, and the and, first time I watched like what I said, the first thing I said was like they're not using a condom. Like that was like, <laughs> yeah. I was like whoa, so, whoa, yeah. holy shit. Yeah, it was yeah, fuck, it was wild. That's so that's such a funny fucking. Fuck you, Nathan. You ruined my life. <laughs> that's <laughs> such a funny this. funny comment to yeah. make. Whoa, they're not. Hey, yeah. hey. hey, I was safe. I was yeah, safe. in your head, yeah, you're just I like, wow, safe, they're not yeah. being safe about this. Yeah, I don't, exactly. I don't know about all yeah. that. That's fucking <laughs> hilarious. Um, yeah, man, dude, that's. I want, but like now, I wonder if, uh, dude, they can just like screen share and shit. They're probably just like, oh yeah, they're probably. just talking online and they're just like, hey, dude, look at this. Yeah, like, you don't even have to go over to your friend's house anymore. Your friend could just fucking send you the video and it just pops up on your shit. Yeah, man. And, you, and then it's just yeah, it's just some like yeah, some crazy head tie. And the next thing you know, your parents find about fucking. <laughs> 200 head time yeah, videos and their 15 year old kids thing and they're just like uh, that's dark man like I don't know if that guy is gonna be okay like, I know, man. at such an early age like you gotta be like yo bro like you gotta fucking you, Chill, you yeah. got yeah man like this is I know it seems like a you may you, like, you had this fucking thing when you're young and it just yeah. kind of got you but it's like dude you don't want to go down that yeah, exactly. <laughs> you do not want to go down that path yeah cause like me and my brother like we used to, I, I was the one with the iPod right so yeah. then what would happen is like I'd be like, I'd be like, you know, jerking off at night. And he would like come upstairs sometimes at like 11, 12. Yeah. And be like, can I use it? <laughs> oh like, my God. And I'd be like, I'm still jerking off. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking uh, awesome. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. hilarious. The boys. Fun. That's yeah. funny. Yeah. I didn't have a brother, so I don't know if, yeah. That would have been funny if me and my sister were fucking switching oh. back, <laughs> yeah. back and forth. Yeah. Just like, no, you had it last night. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. We're both looking at fucking lesbian shit. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, hold on. I just quickly want to see what this fucking Should teacher says to this guy or, to the boys. Way up here to right down here. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> what the? Like the video said. Guys come in all shapes and sizes. And that goes for your genitals too. <laughs> <laughs> I have a micro penis. <laughs> I see your your dick's big, man. Like, <laughs> he just leads it right yeah. in the fucking kid at the front. Yeah. He's just yeah. like, yeah. you're gonna have a small dick. Yeah. Yeah. And that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> and he's just like, listen, I've seen all you guys in gym yeah. class. He's like Jared at the back there. He's fucking packing yeah. already. He's like ten. He's already packing. <laughs> he's got Mrs. Smith. Dragging <laughs> this is fucking hilarious. That's so funny that you fucking. Oh, then the whole crew's like talking outside. Oh, post credit scene. Shit. <laughs> Clock today. Who knows? I think it's, yes, the brain. Today we're delving into the mind of the average boy. Ah, I can't look. <laughs> what are you looking at? Tits. <laughs> <laughs> he's checking out some ass is what he was doing and then it cuts to the credits oh fuck that's awesome that's so funny holy shit um are the comments available i want to see what the... <laughs> oh yeah i remember watching this video being in shock because when my mom had to talk with me she neglected to tell me that it's once a month for the rest of your life i was oh, under the impression that it happened once oh damn that's a scam um, this is surprisingly nostalgic. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there yeah. You go. <laughs> uh, fuck. Okay, bro, relax. This is so vital to human <laughs> yeah, development. Thank you for posting. Yeah. It's Stephanie TV. Can you go to her channel? I want to see who the fuck this what is. she's doing. Yeah, what's she about? Eighty-one subscribers. Let's go, girls. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Okay. <laughs> this is important for vital for human development. Wow, twenty second long. I understand why she thinks this is. Yeah. Mean, yeah. Well, yeah, she developed real well. Yeah. She developed <laughs> yeah. into a fucking yeah, yeah, real, real fucking productive part of society. Holy she like, shit. why didn't this get an Oscar? Yeah. <laughs> like, <she> like, <laughs> really put together a nice piece yeah. of a uh, nice piece of content there.
Wait, you have, you have YouTube Premium? Yeah, bro. Oh, do you know do you know about AdBlock? Yeah, bro. Oh, oh, dude, okay. I had, okay. but I feel okay. it would it would still just pop up oh, and like okay. and like okay. it would be it would just be like blank and like okay, I'd have to like it. wait for it a little bit. Right. But um, yeah, I don't know. It never really worked for me. I just okay. got sick of it and fucking right. uh, um. Okay, here. Well, there's two left that I kind of want to. Sure. Oh, but fucking. Yeah, we can just watch whatever. Okay. Um. Fuck. I'm trying to see. Okay. This one's this one's kind of fun. These are just the boys hanging out, you know, having a fun little chat. And um, this one also looks pretty old too. Um, but you know. Took a cup. I filled it up. What I found out later was about seven ounces of urine. And I looked at it. And I said, "This is the craziest thing I've ever done." And I just banged it all down. <laughs> it like a beer. And it surprised me. All it tasted was like uh, warm seawater. <laughs> Did he say like a bear? Warm seawater. No, but like before he was like, I, oh, a beer. Oh, a beer. Yeah. Okay, I was like, yeah. what the fuck? It okay. just tasted like a beer. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> I mean, I've had urine before. Really? I, like a little bit, like a taste, like a drop. You know, I don't just remember. like it. Just like, had I know like, what it had to like, like hit yeah, your yeah. lips. Like when I was a kid, you know, like I've had. Yeah, yeah, like I don't. Yeah, it's just unintentionally. Not, yeah, like unintentionally. Okay, but like I don't know. <laughs> okay, I don't know. It's like yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> That's just fucking, I, dude. I love it. This guy's look at this guy's like inquisitive, yeah. fucking, just like just listening intentively, just like hmm. Yeah. And this, I filled it up, but I found out later it was about seven ounces. He looks mad. Like, he looks mad. <laughs> I looked at it. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> like, he looks mad. Like, <laughs> He's like, what the fuck yeah. is this shit, bro? Of urine. And I looked at it. And I said, this is the craziest thing I've ever done. And I just banged He's like, I, he's okay. like mic'd like up. Like, what is this situation? Yeah. Okay, that, that, that's not the craziest thing he's ever done. Because he said it so casually. Yeah. So he's done crazier shit. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. And like, the, the, yeah, look at the, his demeanor yeah. while he's saying this. He's like smiling and shit. Yeah. Like the craziest thing some, you've ever done, you keep that to your grave. Yeah. Like I have things I will never you say to anyone. Yeah. You don't yeah. gather your boys yeah, and yeah, fucking, exactly. yeah. So <laughs> make, sure you're, make sure you're mic'd up yeah. and fucking. He's willing to share the story. So yeah. he's beyond fucked. Like he's done, you know. Oh, yeah. Well, I think anybody who's willing to just slam, like knowing slam back about seven ounces of their own urine yeah. is you know look at, the, yeah, look at that smile man. yeah dude like, this guy yeah this guy's pumped about this yeah. he would do it again tonight <laughs> yeah. If, if, yeah if he, like if, if somebody was just like hey you want to do it again right now he would be like yes yeah. <laughs> he would absolutely be yes um okay we'll end on this one so i right. i feel like i forget what this one is oh this one's hilarious my name is joe kramer and i'm a massage instructor until i was 30 years old I hated my asshole. <laughs> <laughs> what? At thirty? Yeah. What? <laughs> at thirty, everything changed. Yeah. What happened when he was? Uh, what, what do you think happened when he was thirty? I think he discovered like anal massage. Yeah. I think that that's I yeah, self anal massage for men. Okay. So, and, but before that, did he say he was like scared? Years old. I hate it. No, I hate it. Hate it. That's a strong <laughs> word. <laughs> what do you? He had cool. fucking. He had legit beef with his the asshole coach, before this. That, that pre puberty video is the origin story. Yeah, and yeah. The coach did something. Yeah, that, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, some shit would have had to have yeah. happened for him to hate his fucking butthole. Yeah. And um, I mean, because that's a harsh word. Yeah, he hated it. But like, what? Yeah. Like, why? Yeah. yeah. Like, what would have happened unless you're. If you're just like a regular guy, I mean, I don't, I don't see why there's any reason to, you know, love or hate your yeah. your butthole. Yeah, but you should be neutral. It's yeah, like, it's it, yeah. Um, so something must have gone down, and then, but see, then he, but then, also he's able to swing so heavily on this one. So yeah. he went from you know hate. That's why he's pro was able to kind of swing this other way, very extreme about uh, you know his feelings about his asshole. Yeah. That now he's just like obsessed with it. I feel like this video and the urine video are probably connected. Like, there's a lot of body parts. <laughs> In this, you've had a lot of body parts ones. <laughs> <laughs> unintentionally, yeah. unintentionally. Uh, but I, I'm just, I'm just amazed by these, like, these videos. Just yeah. the, the setup of all of this, mm. of like how somebody is just like has this, has this idea to say, and then it's like a production. Yeah, I'm like, I'm amazed because this is like, this is like a crew. Like, yeah, especially like true. the last one, the fucking, the cyber sex one, there's like a crew involved in this and they were just like, okay, we got to get this, you know, like high quality video, like, especially like these ones are old yeah. and they're like pretty good, uh, quality for like, you know, however long ago they're like audio's fucking clear. Like they, they, like they, they put some production value into these things and they're just saying 
crazy shit. Yeah, the nine. I guess the nineties, eighties. It was a special time, man. Yeah. It was a, I kind of, I kind of wish. Part of me wishes I grew up then, but yeah. like, part of me is like, I guess I'm happy to be here now. I, I think know. we got like, how old are you? I'm 24. 24. Okay, yeah. Yeah, similar age. Um, so we kind of got like a little bit of like the end tail end of like that. True. That kind of shit, but yeah. then we also didn't get fully all just like this shit. Yeah, that's like, a good point. Yeah. So, like, we we're kind of somewhere in the middle, uh, which is nice. We got kind of, like, you know, a mix of the two at least. Because, um, like, yeah, I don't know. Fucking one way or the other. Because if you get caught just, like, you know, all grew up in the 90s and stuff, like, you're when it comes to all, the, like, how fast everything's progressing and all the yeah. technology now, you're like, there's no way you can catch up. Yeah, Like, true, true, true. Uh, you, you're yeah. just, you're forever going to be behind on understanding all this shit and being, yeah. like, forward with it. Um, and if you only grew up with it, then I feel like that also comes with its own, like, mental thing yeah. that you're, like... And we don't even know the effects. Like, yeah. we don't know the effects until, like, 30, until it's too late. Yeah. <laughs> of, like, what... Because I feel like the is. kids that, like... Because, like, when we were young, young, we didn't have... We still didn't have, like, screens right yeah, away. True. Like, yeah. like, I got two, like, uh, young nephews, and they're, like, already fucking ipads and like they're yeah. like wa like watching stuff and like, they know how to use it yeah too. Like exactly. they really they know how to navigate it it's fucking crazy completely. yeah yeah like when we were like around that age like my nephew's about like to turn three he knows how to fucking work an ipad like when i was three it was still like vhs yeah. tapes were we just and, dumb like, though maybe we were just dumber <laughs> like, we were just dumb we were but like dumb. I, uh, yeah, yeah I, I guess we just had less to figure out yeah exactly. like so we just were yeah. presented with less so that's it, true. It, i it knew was, how to rewind a vhs yeah tape, and that's really change it rewind it yeah but then i wonder if we're like i wonder if and there's no real way to kind of, I guess, gauge it. But if we're, we were like more creative in a sense, because we kind of, or like, more, I guess maybe creative or just more imaginative, because we yeah. just kind of had to like create our own fun That's true. instead we of outside. like, yeah. yeah. Outside a lot. And like, because like, dude, I remember me and my friends would just, we would just make games. Yeah. Like, we would just invent like sports, like just combining shit. We would just make games up. Yeah. We would fucking, I was just like, I, I feel like everything is like, the games are already there. Yeah. And they just pull them up. And they play other shit instead of like, you know, coming up with their own well, stuff. I would argue that because I used to, I was, I worked with kids in like after school program for a couple of years yeah. and like it still exists. Kids still play outside. The whole thing of like kids never play outside yeah. isn't true. But it's like, it's the parents. That's what it is. It's yeah. not because it's like if the kids, if you let a kid play his iPad for eight hours, you right. Know. But if you're like, hey, it's summer, go outside on your bike, you yeah. will as well. So yeah. it's, it's more the parents and like, it's more like, it's just about the parents need to push them more yeah. in the direction of like, yo, go, go out, experience outside. Because yeah. I, I would be really, cause I had a lot of fun, like, you know, in summers, like doing like kick the can and shit, yeah. just like going out on my bike all day. And I'm happy that my parents didn't let me stay inside and play mm -hmm. video games, but I knew some kids who did. Yeah. So it's like, yeah. But I feel, yeah, like, and I feel like parents are, going away from that of like yeah. the letting the kids especially like like maybe play outside like the backyard and stuff but letting kids like roam around because they're like yeah, oh i don't know <laughs> but I, I feel like it's not that <laughs> like comparatively i don't think it's more dangerous like than no, it really yeah. was well if this guy is still out there i'd be like <laughs> <laughs> this guy's in my neighborhood. <laughs> hey it's self-anal massage yeah, okay yeah, true. as far as we know yeah he's just just himself yeah, it's just true. himself as yeah. of right now i mean his his look and <laughs> everything may you know indicate otherwise yeah. but uh, but we can't we can't legally go out and make that claim that's fair um but yeah it is also like i mean parents just are just it's just a way to not have to parent yeah it is it's easy though it's they just so easy. yeah it's the, so much they just shove yeah. it in there and then then yeah. it's just quiet and they parents can do it like their own thing they get yeah. to scroll their own bullshit and then so like instead of being like either going outside with them or like going outside and just like supervising they're yeah. just like here like yeah, take this. Yeah. you're not now it's not my problem yeah and uh I, yeah you can just notice like a lot more of that but it, it's like i wonder if that like what that'll be like for the difference of like growing up in like a city or like because like where my sister yeah. lives my my nephews will at least have like a backyard and it's just and like you know okay like whereas like a city like the kid uh, is like living in like a fucking like condo yeah like where's the outside yeah, to go true. play? Yeah, like, even the parks are like so. This parks are like just like surrounded by concrete. Like it's just yeah. this little grass patch, and there's and a, then just like the parks are just you know littered with homeless people. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so, so you're like, yeah, you're just like yeah, just like I'd love to go down this slide, but there's uh, currently a, <laughs> yeah. a, a, you know a dead homeless person yeah. on it. Like, yeah. Well, I mean, you can climb on it. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, <laughs> I like, you know, could know. climb up and down the stairs yeah. at the back of the slide. Yeah, we'll, maybe go. we'll uh, we'll call fucking yeah. we'll call, call the fire department to get this guy's body out of here so we can use the slide. 
slide. One thing I don't like too is like the overabundance of safety. Cause like when I used to yeah. work with kids, like that was like a thing too. Of the like, parents was it, or well, was it, was, it like, it was more like the school system. Yeah. Cause, cause they, cause of the parent. parent yeah. Pressure, cause it's yeah. like, they don't want to get fucking, if anything happens to the kid, if the school gets screwed, then it's like, they yeah. rather just like, Oh my God, you have to be super safe. Which yeah. Is like, I don't know. I think it can be a negative over because it's like when you're as you grow up, like you need to you need to have negative experiences. Oh. Like you need to get hurt. Like yeah. when I would hear sometimes when I'd hear bullying, I'd ignore it. <laughs> like, yeah. I'd be like, I'd be like, let's see, like stand up for yourself. And let's yeah. see, you know, like I've I'd I've like, I've you know. always been an advocate for uh like bullying. And then yeah. like <laughs> yeah, like yeah. I've always said because like I mean, dude, it's the it's literally the only reason I found out about like how to be humorous was because like right, i was always right. way smaller than everybody so like you just had to be fucking quick and good with words yeah. and or else you're just gonna get destroyed yeah, exactly. so like if somebody's just making fun of me i would just fucking hit back yeah. and then that's kind of like the, the self-defense thing but nice. then like i understand if it's like a different thing where they're just like well kids getting beat up every day i was like, I was like okay well that's not even bullying anymore yeah, that's, that's just different. assault yeah, your exactly. child's being assaulted yeah. that's very different from bullying yeah. bullying like teasing and like all that stuff like, I mean, there's obviously different levels to it. Like, if it's, like, constantly nonstop, yeah. then that's just, like, yeah, har that's just, like harassment there, as well. There's a line of, like, that's not, like, not yeah. like, trauma shit. Yeah. But like, yeah. That's, like, harassment or, like, assault. But if it's just, like, yeah, like, somebody, like, whatever, making fun of you or, like, somebody's, like, uh, you know, ex trying to exclude you from stuff, yeah. those are all real things that are going to come up. It's not, it doesn't end when school's over. Yeah, exactly. And there's exactly. no, there's yeah. no anti-bullying, yeah. you know, programs when you're an adult and it's going to continue to happen. So you have to learn how to kind of navigate that when you're a child or figure out a way that works for you. Cause yeah, if you just remove it completely, cause then once you become an adult, it's going to happen yeah. <laughs> and you're going to be like, uh, wait, I thought we were, I thought nobody was allowed to do this. Yeah. And it's and just no, like, wait, yeah. where's the anti-bullying committee? It's like, ah, no, we don't have one. Yeah, dude. My, uh, one of my biggest regrets in life is in third grade, I was being bullied and I didn't know how to handle it. Yeah. And I just like, and it was a fat kid and I oh, didn't get to hit damn, him with a fat bro. joke. Oh, damn, like, why bro. did my mom tell me to hit him with a fat <laughs> joke? <laughs> mom, what the yeah. fuck? <laughs> oh man. I, I'm still mad about that. I, what I was it? What was he doing to you? Just like, just talking shit? He would just say like, oh, you have Jeremiah germs and shit. Like, and I was just like, oh shit. thought I had an STI or something oh like, shit I don't know. but like i don't know and then they tried to like exclude me but it was only for like a day yeah but I, like i was like dude i could have hit him with so much oh shit. dude you could have fucking yeah, lit this I kid up destroyed him, dude but, it was, yeah. yeah it used to also just be like yeah because like somebody could say some bullshit like that too but it would just like because it just like the crew it, it didn't matter your material like the strength of your material did not matter at all right. with your crew like they could hit you with that just oh jeremiah like especially i think i saw like a it was like a tweet about this or something um, where it was just like all somebody had to do like in elementary school was just like hit you with like a fucking like a rhyme or an, oh, or, or yeah. an alliteration thing yeah. and you were done. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just like, so like, that's yeah. hilarious. It's just like, Oh fucking Jeremiah germs. Everyone's like, Oh, yeah. Yeah. you're just like, fuck. But the thing is, it wasn't even the big group. Cause it was just like like four of us hanging out together. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, we were cool. So it's like, yeah. it was like, yeah, he was a bully within losers. <laughs> it's like, yeah. That's what it, yeah. <laughs> so it was like, hey, bro, we yeah, already we're, we're already all losers. Yeah. Why are you like, dude? What, are you trying to be the best loser? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right, man. You're yeah, okay. You're Fine. the coolest you're out of win. us. Yeah, that's <laughs> fucking hilarious. Oh, dude, you yeah, you could have lit that kid up. Um, okay, we're at about an hour here. We'll fucking dude. Let's just right. let's just fucking let's just get into it. Hi, I'm. I'm just gonna assume you don't know any better, but I'm gonna. Okay, so the for the people that are just listening, uh, it's a, uh, it's a uh, a person that is got a nice five o'clock shadow, a very nice pink wig on, a nice set of uh, glasses without any lenses, um, some lipstick that's like pink on the lips, but then red around, uh, some good eyeshadow going on, and somebody asked them, "What are your pronouns?" And this is their response TikTok. Kate, you. Um, asking pronouns in 2022 now, it's kind of like saying the N-word. Um, <laughs> it's, it's a derogatory thing now. Um, we now go by adjectives. So it, it's more proper to use somebody's adjectives or to ask them their adjectives. Um, and that's okay. You, you know, we could all do better. Okay. And, you know, as long as you do better, that's all that matters. You know, we're all growing. Um, my adjectives are sexy and gorgeous. So in a sentence, you would say, hey, that's sexy over there. Or, hey, gorgeous, come over here for a minute. So those are my preferred adjectives. Thanks for asking. <laughs> <laughs> that would be hilarious if she was like, or, or I guess if uh, gorgeous yeah. was like, yeah. was like 
uh, it's like saying the N word. Only black people can do it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Holy fuck, that dude. Uh, when I saw that, it's so funny because like you can kind of obviously tell that it's a little bit, you know, j- jokey. Yeah, they're clearly joking about it, but it's just so funny, especially on TikTok. Do you do you have TikTok? Do you use it? I was making TikToks for a bit, but yeah. I was not getting any traction. So yeah, I was like, ah, oh, fuck this. Dude, yeah. it's dude. The comments is I post. Uh, tons of stuff i had one tiktok that fucking like got really popular and then so like now i'm at the point where it gets the videos i post get us like a decent amount of right. views so you get comments and people do not understand like just comedy in general oh, on tiktok so like shit. everything is dead serious okay so they're like so somebody would see this and be like like just lose their mind right. that he said that or that they said uh that it's fucking, you know, the same as saying the N-word. They would, like, write yeah. oh, a okay. comment right, and just right, be right. like, what the fuck yeah. are you talking <laughs> about? Do you even understand? Like, yeah. and then, uh, it's just, it, TikTok is fucking wild. Yeah, bro. I get what you're saying, because I had, I knew someone who, his thing went viral, and it was just like a, uh, just like a joke about, like, First Nations people or whatever, just like stand-up, mm-hmm. just like a joke. And, like, there was, like, response videos oh. of people thinking it was, like, serious. And it, they, they were like, Oh, you can't say that, but it was like it's cl- it's clearly stand up. comedy. Yeah, yeah, that's like, even you know, wilder because it's it was, yeah, it's not there's it's stand up comedy. Yeah, like, obviously there's no it's not even like up to interpretation. Of I know you're not. So that was yeah, you know, but that's the thing is like it doesn't even like the idea of comedy are just like words being used like for humor and not like everything is like a serious statement. Right, just like doesn't exist. Okay, it's and then like they just attack. It's okay. hilarious. And like, I just put po- like, I post like just podcast clips, okay. which I understand there's a little bit more room there. Cause there are people that do just dead serious, like fucking podcasts yeah. that are just like, you know, trying to teach you about life, I guess. Yeah. But like, I don't think, I don't think my tone comes across yeah. <laughs> as <laughs> preaching life, uh, <laughs> preaching life advice or like saying anything that's like factual. This is how it is. And if I am, it's like, obviously it's heightened to a level where it's like, that's an absurd thing to say. Yeah. And of course, you know, for some people, most people, I would imagine they would be like, oh, OK, so, you know, that's that's absurd. Okay. It's, you know, comedy. Right. But like I had some people fucking attack me because I said that, um, you know, like all the uh, like you you from you, you heard of the you know whole Russia, Ukraine thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So like, you know, like the UK, Ukrainian president like is like have like he's in the shit. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, so like, the right. Ukrainian president who's like a former comedian. Oh, and okay. actor yeah. is now the president of Ukraine, and he's just like he's like involved. He's like fighting in the oh, war, in the shit. war, and he's okay. just like he's just like yeah, fucking badass dude, whatever. He's like fighting the war, but he's like posting. There was like a bunch of videos, and like he was posting even videos and like selfies and stuff of like him. And I was just, I literally was just like talking about how badass it is that they have a like like a president, a politician who legitimately will actually just fight, right. and like how there's no fucking way in hell anybody like our North America that would happen. Yeah. And then I was like, however, for somebody that's apparently in the middle of a war, he's posted, he's doing a lot of fucking Instagram yeah. <laughs> and dude, people were just like, shut the fuck yeah. up. You have okay. no idea what you're yeah. talking about. And they were just like, stop talking. And like, they were just so angry. I was like, dude, it's a fucking yeah. joke, bro. But internet, internet anger is hilarious. Yeah. I've also had a troll. Like I posted a uh, stand up clip on Reddit Oh, and oh Jesus! Somebody <laughs> like in this, and some guy was like, "I will literally delete my account." It's so <laughs> about this. Like it's like, dude. Like I went to his account. And it was like a troll account. It is sad because mm. who the fuck spends their time? I know, trolling? Man. It's like it's sad, man. Yeah, like, it's, like, it's fucking really sad. And also, yeah. just like, who's who's commenting? Yeah, because like, do you know anybody who's a commenter? They're probably in the closet though. Like it's probably yeah, like you it's know, like it's, it's probably like probably it's like, like a fucking shameful like yeah, exactly. thing that they do. They yeah. don't fucking bring it up. Yeah. That was uh, me who commented on your Ukraine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were hiding it. It was like actually, yeah, yeah, that's why I came by today. I yeah. want to do it. This is my ploy. I, I actually wanted to waste your time. <laughs> I, wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to bring it up with you personally. Yeah. And uh, but yeah, man, that's it's, not okay. I don't that's to, not yeah. Yeah. Okay, he's yeah. legitimately fighting yeah. for his country. Have some respect for the people of Ukraine. Um. Yeah, bro. And then I was just like talking about how like like you imagine fucking you know like people like people we know and like just people from Canada and like North America going to a fucking war. 
Like uh, I don't know anyone who could. I like I, even my friend who's like a more of like into the military. It's like I, I don't see you. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, exactly. You have asthma. Yeah, <laughs> like, you have, you have, yeah. Uh, yeah. We, we all have like fucking mental health yeah. issues. <laughs> like, what the fuck are we gonna yeah. do in a war? Um, but uh, dude, look at look at these guys. What are we gonna fucking? What are we gonna do? This is this is what's going on in Russia. The people listening, there's two Russian guys in a forest uh, training abs. And one guy's hanging off of a fucking tree uh, doing like some, you know, like some leg lifts over top of this other guy who's just massive. And he has a giant tattoo of a sword down his back. And he's wearing one of those Russian little like hat things. And then he's like punching him in the stomach, you know, training abs. And then just behind them about, you know, like maybe 10 feet to the right. There's a bear shaking the tree <laughs> that is just like watching them. Like he's a part of it. And then there's like a camera guy I saw off to the side, but Jesus <laughs> look Christ. at these guys. And what? We're supposed to like no, what? We can't compete. And, wait, what are we yeah. gonna do? <laughs> what the fuck are we gonna do? That's hilarious. Um I'm happy I'm on this side of the world, man. I'm yeah, happy. bro. <laughs> My biggest problem is like I'm gonna see the Batman tonight, and I'm hungry, so I don't know if I should where I should get dinner before. Like that's my problem. Yeah, so that's yeah, my yeah, problem. yeah, it's yeah. Like that's, yeah. Holy fuck. Um, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm going. Again. Well, hey, I'm going. I'm doing boxing on Wednesday. I'm doing my first class. So. Oh really? I think I'm ready to compete with these guys. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I just just, just to do something. Yeah. Really, yeah. eh? What have you been, like? Have you kind of been like thinking about it for a while? Yeah, like I was always thinking about it, and like yeah. my schedule's cleared up a bit now, so I'm just gonna go check it out. Yeah. So, so yeah. Um, have you like? Are you a fan of boxing? Are you like? Uh, uh, no, you, like, like I've never been a fan of watching any sport, but I've okay. always loved playing sport, sports. So, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Which is like, dude, yeah, boxing is uh it's, it's fucking frustrating. Cause like you, it, in your head, especially like when you've never done it before, you just think you're just like, oh, okay, yeah, 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 like. Like, you know, you get in there, you're just like, I kind of understand, like, throwing a punch and stuff. And then especially if you go to, like, a good place or get anybody that's, like, good at teaching you how to do it, it's the most frustrating thing in the world you immediately want to fucking quit. Because it's yeah. just, like, it's just, they make it so, like, tedious where it's just, like, okay. just, like, little steps and then, like, just fucking throw, like, a hundred jabs, like, right. over. And, like, my roommate... uh fought for, like, a while doing, like, Muay Thai and, like, kickboxing. So, like, sometimes even if I just, like, fuck around... And uh, like just just hit mitts with him now. Yeah. He's still kind of like in that mentality where he just like j I'll just jab for like ever. Oh, okay. And he's just like, yeah, no, your feet. Da 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 da. Um, oh shit! Actually, you know what's funny? I just watched this video before. I'd seen it before, but uh, maybe you should go in and uh, you should go in and do this. So, um, yeah, this is funny. Here we'll we'll end off on this. So. All right. So this is what you don't do. So it's two guys. Uh, they're in the boxing gym. Yeah. Some guy comes in and he just starts talking shit. And he's just uh, and he's just like he 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 wants to fucking he wants to go. You came here for a reason. You came here to kick my ass. You came here to kick your coach's ass. Dude, let's go. You think I didn't come down here? You think I drove all this way because I didn't fucking look you up or do or do research on you? I'm not fucking. I don't hope you did do research. On you. I don't want to kick So this is like a guy who like thinks he's like fucking street tough and he's coming to this gym. He's like he's like I'm gonna beat the fuck out of this coach. This is what you should do when you fucking yeah. pull up. <laughs> To immediately go to the coach and just be like, let's go. I like how he said I want to be trained. It sounds like a movie. Like, yeah. it sounds like. Have the guy walk into your, in your, your, it's your gym. You never had this? You never had this before, brother? No, I have not. <laughs> He's just kind of playing with him a little bit. The guy, like, throws a few punches. <laughs> oh. Oh, fuck. oh <laughs> <laughs> Just immediately knocks the guy down. You all right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah.
You think so? <laughs> Still kind of confident? <laughs> it's like, he wants out so bad. So he old. wants out so bad, but he can't do it. Yeah. Ego can't do it. It's so old. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Charges him. <laughs> he didn't have a plan when he charged him. I know. Just like <laughs> it's so crazy to me when guys are like, like for like this late in in life, and they still have like such an ego. Yeah. It's like yeah. how have how have you not how have you not how has life not checked you? Yeah. Like so many times that like you act like a regular person yeah. like how do you still act like this yeah because everyone's everyone's a bit of a pussy right because yeah. it's like no one's really that tough like we most people have here anyway have pretty comfortable lives so yeah it's like you know and if someone disrespects you like yeah stand up for yourself but like mm -hmm. there's no yeah i'm no people don't want to fight you know? yeah That's exactly like, yeah people that's the fucking point people don't the, yeah. people don't want to fight and it, like the majority of don't know how to fight. Yeah, yeah. So it's like fucking almost like dangerous. It's like yeah. this shit. Yeah. yeah like, yeah, and then you get one person that knows how to fight and then, uh, but it's just crazy. Like, um, I was never, uh, I was never like a fucking big, like going out guy, but like I had friends that would fucking, and the friends that would like try to like, that would like get into scraps or whatever, shit. like at the bar. Yeah. But it's just like, uh, like it was crazy to me that fucking level of like just ego and craziness yeah. where they were just like, there's like, oh then uh, that's it. Yeah. I gotta fucking, I'll, I'll snap. I gotta go. And there's like, you don't know how to fight. Where does yeah. this come? <laughs> yeah. Where does this come from? Yeah. That you think that like you're some badass who's gonna fuck some dude up? Like it's just like, dude, you don't know. How to, you're just a drunk right. that like is like you know has misguided anger. Yeah. <laughs> well, I've seen. Have you ever? I've seen someone almost get like a justified. They almost got beat up. Oh yeah. But it was like what happened was it was like this chick. This was a bar. Yeah. She was like mad at a guy. So she threw a bottle, like a beer bottle, mm. and missed the guy, smashed another girl in the face. Oh, like the shit. Eye, and then that girl starts, like, chasing her. And yeah. I was like, it's justified if she gets her ass kicked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, I was like, yeah. like, like, you can't, there's certain things where mm -hmm. it's like, you can't throw a bottle and yeah. just not, like. And no, yeah, yeah there's yeah, no yeah. repercussion for yeah. it whatsoever. Um, yeah, I mean, I remember sometimes, like, I mean, I wasn't really friends with them, like, long after that. But I would just, like, any friends that would like get or like start some shit or get into some shit and then just be like, what the fuck? Like, yeah. or if they got their ass kicked and there's like, you, you, you weren't, you would back us up. It's, hey, if you're a dumb fuck that, yeah. st that starts a fight and then gets his ass kicked, I don't yeah, know. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> yeah. Like, dude, just because you, just because, you know, we're friends doesn't mean I have to get my ass beat too. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, yeah. what are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> I never understood that. It's like, no, we're boys, bro. If I, <laughs> you got to back me. Yeah. What the fuck? No, dude, you're the one that deserves the ass kicking. Yeah. I didn't do shit, dude. I was just fucking trying to enjoy myself. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, I don't know. But um, yeah, I 100% think you should go into that boxing gym and fucking yeah. just immediately call the guy out. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, I'll do that. Is I'll, it like legit? Is it like a, you like just a regular like boxing gym or is it like uh, some cardio it's, boxing? It's just like a regular boxing gym. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah. yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. That's uh, that's sick. Oh damn, you're gonna be you're gonna be fucking dangerous out here in these oh, streets totally, now. Dude. Just yeah. three classes in, you're just gonna yeah. you're gonna be walking different. <laughs> yeah. The shoulders are gonna come up a little bit. I'm fucking worried. <laughs> chest like, is popped yeah. out, chin's a little higher. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you're fighting, then chin's tucked down nice and low. Um. All right. Well, let's fucking uh. That's it. Um. Jeremiah, go ahead and uh, plug your shit. Fucking yeah. you know your social medias that people uh let them know where to yeah, find for you. Sure. At. Uh. Jeremiah Porphy. Uh, you can check out my website, www. Ooh, he's got a website. Yeah, hell yeah. W you could pull it up right now. All right, all right. Pull all right. it up right now. Uh W dot J E R E M I A H U dot com. Um, you can buy my book Hive today on Amazon or check out Oh damn. Yeah, check out my website, check out my comedy. My Instagram is Jeremiah U K P O N. R-E-F-E. Um, if you're in Vancouver, I have a couple shows coming up. I have um, a show at the Amsterdam Cafe on Monday, uh, March 28th. Uh, the Big Smoke Show, a weekly show at Container Brewing on Tuesday nights. And on the 16th, I have a show at House of Comedy, the Funny Side Up Showcase. So check that shit out. Oh, fucking yeah. hell yeah. This book, did you, uh, did you have to get it like... Uh like, what was the publishing process like? For I this? just uh, self-published, so I had to, I actually had to hire an editor. Mm -hmm. I got a shitty editor, so I put it out, and then there was grammar mistakes, so I had oh, to read, I had to read, no. I had to wait a long ass time. Where'd you find an edit? where'd you find this fuck uh, fuckhead editor? It was on, uh, on a Upwork. 
Uh, so it was just like, oh, fuck. Okay. But then I went to like a professional editor and now everything's all good. Yeah. So yeah, that's what's the, the uh, what's the, what's the deal with fucking this, uh, this book? You give us like a kind of a. Yeah, for sure. It's a uh, sci-fi. So it's pretty much about a world where there was an alien called the hive and humanity th- th- thought they defeated it, but it's returned and they slowly discover that there's more to the alien than they thought. It's the first book in the arcane volumes, nine books. So it's going to take a while. We're coming a second long way right to now. fucking yeah. go. How'd you, how'd you come to the, how'd you come to the like conclusion and that there's going to be nine? Um, well, as I was, this was actually originally going to be a solo book, but as I, started to write the second book, I could see that there could be a connection between the two. Mm-hmm. And the series is about different, it starts off with different planets, which eventually will come together. Holy but fuck, But that's like dude. book six. Yeah. yeah. That's book seven, so. Holy yeah. fuck, dude. That's crazy to me. Yeah, yeah that's, uh, that's wild. My brain, I, I don't, I don't think I have any, any of that. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, just the fucking, that's so crazy to just have like, an entire like universe in your head that's yeah, yours. You. <laughs> like it's, yeah. it's super impressive. Yeah. Uh, honestly, I'll fucking, I'm going to, I'm going to read this book right. and awesome. um, it, you better hope I don't get fucking obsessed with it. Cause I'll hound you about the yeah. fucking bro. Where Second, the fuck, where the fuck's yeah. the other eight, bro. Second one will come out in about a year. So, I mean, don't All get right. it now. Like, yeah. I'd, I'd honestly wait like 10 years, man. Like that, Just, that, they, that's yeah. when you'll have a few. So, All right. All yeah. right. All right. Sounds good. All right. Yeah. Um, yeah, man. Thanks for coming to hang All out. Right. Yeah, no problem. All Thank right. You. Peace.